Hello SeaWorld fans, we're here for Tonga Twister today. It's a media day, today's Friday, uh, March 6th, and I'm headed to Aquatica. As you can see, the park's closed, so there's really nobody here. I've got the whole park for myself, I wish. Um, so, we're going to go ahead and check in over here by the media table and uh, get into Aquatica and check out that brand new translucent slide from Whitewater that they just installed. And those who have been following me know about Solar Vortex, which is also a, um, a similar slide, but it's a raft. This one's a body slide, so it uh, should be very interesting. Okay, everybody, we're here with two of the new translucent slides for Tonga Twister. We have a purple one that ends up and a green one, and they slide in. They're all integrated with all the other slides, as you can see here, which is really neat. Now, what makes these slides a little different is the translucent technology where they shine through, like I was mentioning earlier with the uh, solar vortex. Now, I'm here today with Nick, my buddy Nick, that I kind of missed. Uh, he's always missed out on some media events, but I finally got him here, so that's good. Um, he's going to be our test rider, and he's going to let us know exactly how it feels and what it looks like inside. You I'm ready for it? To it. Awesome. Hi, everybody. We're here with Lise, who happens to be. Go ahead and introduce yourself, please. Hi, I'm Lise Collins. I'm the vice president of Aquatica. Okay, cool. And this new slide, can you tell us some of the features on it? I can. So Tonga Twister, brand new for 2020. It is an aqua lucid slide. So what that means is that we have different light features and we have sound. And so when you go through the tube, you can see the different designs on the outside of our slide. And when you go through the tube, you actually see those reflecting into the slide as you're going down. So it gives you the illusion that there's flowers all around you or spirals or you're going past the whole lot of blinds. It, you can see the pressure going really fast. So that it's a really awesome. fun experience. That's awesome. Now, can you tell us the difference between this and Solar Vortex and Bush Garden? So Solar Vortex actually has is a tube slide. So that you actually get it on a tube. So it's a very similar experience with the Aqua Lucid. We have a little bit more uh, different designs. So on Adventure Island, they are, um, the theming is a little different. So we tried to take more of that Maori theme that we have here at Aquatica and incorporate those designs here, as opposed to at Solar Vortex, where they have a lot more of those colorful lines and whatnot. Looks great, looks awesome over there, but we're so excited about Tonga Twister here. That's so cool. And I noticed you added two, not one. That was a nice touch. Cut back those lines, because they are going to be nice and full. Cool. Yep. Okay, so are they two different experiences? Yes, absolutely. There's not even the same designs in both slides. So if you go down one, you, you have to come back up and go down the second one because, again, those two different experiences in the slide. That is awesome. Do you know the approximate time that you're going to be experiencing that ride? About? It, depends, it, uh, it depends on the rider. So it can be anywhere from about 15 to 30 seconds. Again, it just depends on the rider, but it's a fun ride the whole time. Sound going, you can just be jamming out while you're down that slide. I love it. Now, is the music that's in here, does it change up or is it just always the same? So it's a top 40, so we uh, have the top 40 kind of rotating through there, so it's not the same song. So you might get a different experience every time you go, because the likelihood of you getting that same song is going to be different. I love that. Okay, uh, what other features? Are there any other, besides the translucent technology that was added by Whitewater, is there anything, and the music, of course, uh -huh. anything else that we're missing on that might be in there hidden? No, it's just that it's a really great experience and that Aqua Lucid really great. It's the first one in San Antonio, so we're really excited about that. So it's really neat to bring that again to the people here in Texas and again, just a, a great addition to our park. Wow, that's awesome. Well, we're going to get Nick on there and he's going to ride it for us and see how it is. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate that. How was that, that one? one? so much better. Is it? From that, from that luminescence, the, the colors are so much better, more vivid. Are they really? really like really. like how much more vivid? Just more the color patterns? The sun, it, more color patterns. Okay, cool. Shine right through. Music? The music could be up on that one more. Okay, cool. I feel like the uh, purple one, has, the music comes through better. Very nice. Okay, thanks Nick. Awesome.
How was that, huh? That was very fun. Nice. How did the Okay. Nice. How did the uh, design inside the tube sound? I mean, look, it was they it pretty cool? Amazing. Amazing. Very, I, very cool. Is it like kind of like a neon effect coming in? Yeah. You, like you that I saw in the video. See it very clearly. Very nice. How about the music? Can you hear it clearly? You can. Wow, that is phenomenal. Great. Like if you keep your head up a little bit, yeah, I can hear it. Awesome. Are you ready to ride the green one? I am ready to try the other.